Good evening, guys. How are we doing tonight? Congratulations, Sakura. Uh, do you still have to do data org? Uh, you said so. You beat Roxas and Lingering Will. Uh, do you still have to do the rest of the data org? Or are you all done? Either way, that's doing that stuff on level one. Uh, not easy. You're not doing the data fights. Don't feel, just don't feel like it just because you've done most you've done the fights already it's just more painful versions or at least you've done like the ba the regular version of the fight if you be Roxas then you can take care of the rest true but didn't you want to fight Marluxia and his one shot mechanic on level one again you didn't want to do that again you didn't want to have to beat, uh, do Dance Water Dance with all of those clones again? You didn't want to pause buffer for, uh, Luxord again? All that fun stuff? <sighs> yeah, I can understand why. It's not worth it. I, I I feel I like pause buffering for that. It's just like once you get to the end, it's just like it's just a 50-50 and you always lose the 50-50. It feels like. But hey, you do you. But yeah, we're gonna be doing some more Octopath today. Um we're like in the middle of our chapter threes. I do still have I have another part of a chest chapter two I can do now that I'm like appropriately leveled, so we're gonna be doing that. So yeah, uh let's get into it. If the music pauses we'll switch in and tab back in so let's see we lasted like temenosis chapter two. Oh, and the chest chapter three is right here or next part of our chapter two so let's just change up our party and then we'll get going you battled him but you ran out of, you ran out of time just fi so just finishing off roxas and uh lingering will was, was enough understandable all right so we need to add a chet into the party we'll play sakati uh, Temenos has some levels, so... Particio or Oswald? I'll do a Particio. Unequip all. Unequip all. Optimize. Get all the damage stuff on her. Um, let's set up our jobs. I don't know what I want to make him. He looks drippy as all hell with the inventor, but I only could have one inventor at a time. Slightly unfortunate. Um, let's see. It's like nobody ever wants to be a thief. I could do Dancer for some buffs, I guess? But I already have... Um, what's her name? Agnea, so I don't. I guess, when in doubt, Cleric for potential heals. Alright, you got the best healing weapons. You got the best physical weapons. Let's optimize. Uh, JP Augmenter, Octopus Pot. All right, let's do this. Recommended level 29, we should be fine with this. One creature alighted on red wilds, a mountain glowed and boiled with heat as its time to erupt drew near. The creature struck a blow of rage. The mountain cracked and sank into a valley. The creature of legend that guarded that land was named Terra. How can we, how convenient. There's a Terra in this game as well, Sakura. Terra, come on out. Terra, where are you? 
I'm sure that's gonna work. It's not answering. Oh, I bet everybody's just be? confused seeing that seeing a, a beastling and a talking owl. Do you smell anything, Ochet? Mm, not a whiff. I tried I'm making so, myself a um, so exhausted. like a latte. A little? Um, my mom has a mocha pot, and I sometimes uh, you have to know I when to quit. It, heat, heated up some milk in the Good microwave point. and combined that. It turned out okay. Something to get me some caffeine to get through the rest of the day. Wait, I got a twinge. <laughs> I also, Good old um, I also got a haircut, and uh. That was nice. Since I left work at four, my haircut place that's literally across Tara the street nearby. closes at five. So I was like, there goes I literally got home and I was like, Should all right, we we're booking it. Now? Just putting my, sh Sounds my like shit down and not running straight to the uh, to the barber. Oh, chat. She's just eating meat mm. randomly. You can't hunt on an empty stomach. Mm. 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 Want some? Yes, please. <laughs> <My Hina. laughs> oh, that was good. I like that. Did you hear? You can use coins to tell your fortune. Tell your fortune? If you want to know whether a wish will come true, just toss a coin into the air. If it lands on heads, your wish will come true. Tails, it won't. See? <sighs> wow, how do coins know that? Heh, <laughs> you got a wish, Ochet? I wish to have King Iguana for dinner tomorrow. Right, let's consult the coin. Go ahead and toss this baby. Got it. And, ah, what the? Hmm? I lost sight of it. So what's the answer? I guess this means you gotta make your wish come true yourself. I'm proud of her. She tried her best. you got there I've never seen one of those can I pet it Mahina be nice sorry sorry she startled me it's all right she just wants to be friends pet the owl she does but she can't understand what I'm saying Oh, nobody actually understands. Okay, uh, that makes sense. That's true. Nobody actually has addressed that. And I already have you, Ochet. <laughs> Good girl, Mahina. Sorry if that startled you. Have some jerky on me. Uh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> God, she has such a one track mind. Say, that's a cute piece of fluff on your behind. I've never seen the like. Is it rabbit skin? That is my tail. Huh? This? Uh, no, this is my tail. <laughs> You're such a kidder. People don't have tails. <laughs> that aside for a moment. Do you know where Tara is? Tara? What's wrong? Whoa! That. Not again. I guess he's you the source of the earthquake. the whole thing? I'm impressed. Thanks. But, uh... What was that tremor? You there. You said Terra, didn't you? Yeah. The mayor. Oh, hello, mayor. Hey there. Do you know where Terra is? Indeed I do. Far below us. He's probably waking up though. That's why uh when why all the tremors are happening. By interfering with its sleep, the very ground shakes. Yep. As it did just now, in fact. 
Who was fool enough to disturb it? Huh? Terra's in the valley? I came to find it and take it home. Say what? <laughs> Well, you you underestimate her power. Oh, ow. Oh, 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 my stomach playing up. He's running game. away. Get him. Sorry, I'm in no condition to act as guide. Just tell me where to go. Uh huh. Mm. Oh, chat. I know. I smelt the lie, too. <sighs> well, what can you do? Terra must be real scary. We'd better find someone else to show us the way. Gotta find some other name dead in PC. Yo. Sheesh. I'm starving. He's a thick boy. Damn boy, he's thick. Excuse me, do you know where Terra is? Yeah, the Terra? Lingering well, of course I do. Huh. How come you aren't quaking in fear like everyone else we ask? <laughs> I'm too hungry to fret over Terra. Oh, that's probably where it is down those hey, down that ladder. Are you a hunter? Let me ask you a favor. I have some favor? food. Favor? Like what? I've got a hankering for buttermeat like you wouldn't believe. Buttermeat? They're not far from here, but I'm so hungry I can barely move. So, would you go rustle one up for me? Let me add that if it came in the form of tasty food. Fragrant jerky, I wouldn't be upset at all. You ever dried a buttermeat? It's a deeper, smokier flavor. Oh, she's in. Finally, someone who understands. <laughs> Finally, we someone can who talk understands about the alluring jerky. That. You have my word. I mean, hey, a lead is what we need. What's up, Agnia? Seeing how hungry Palm is made me think of Pala. I hope she's eating well. Oh, your little sister? Pala might seem carefree, but she gets lonely easily. When our mother died, she cried for so long. I could barely even get her to eat. I hope she's doing all right without me. I'm sure she's fine, Aggie. Everyone eats when they get hungry enough. <laughs> You're right. I'm overthinking it. Thank you, little chat. Um, I think... Intruding is at night. Alright, so I gotta go find a buttermeat. It's probably best to just. Here I come! Alright! Uh, neither of those are buttermeats, so. Die! Right. Actually, I could probably capture this one. Eh. Mine now. Ah. Oh my god, is the enemy actually gonna hit me? Arrow of fortune! Oh, oh my god, they actually got the around until I find a butter meat. Here I come. Oh, that's My probably what I'm looking for. Yep. Yes. It's my turn now. Just a little. What to do? Gotcha. Uh, well, 
this wow. doesn't kill them. It does not, that's good. I'm just getting warmed up. Arrow of Fortune! Over here! Too slow. Time to shine! We're like with slow! I did it! I'm just getting warmed up! Arrow of Fortune! And I'll capture this. Let's do it! My now! Now let's grab some food! Thank you very much. Steel defenses. Here you go, just like you ordered. Oh, got to. Oh, wow! Buttermeep! And turned into this magnificent jerky! Thank you. Excuse me a moment. Hopefully that'll re uh, revive him. It's so good. So rich, so tasty, it practically melts in your mouth. It's like a dream come true. You're some jerky maker. It's all about how you take down your prey. We hunters have a saying. To enjoy the meat of your quarry is to give it honor and glory. It must Bars. be great to be a hunter, finding food whenever you want it. That was delicious. Now, what did you ask about? Can you tell me where Terra is? I'd be delighted to tell you. A gift of food deserves a rich reward. Can I come with you when you go? Sure. Uh, sure. Especially since I uh, uh, did the guide thing. Because I made up my mind. I'm gonna be a hunter like you. Just because you want to eat jerky? A hunter? Yeah. So I can eat all the tasty food I want. Uh, just uh, watch out for those hunter becomes the hunted situations. Come on, what are we waiting for? Let's go see Terra. She's got some motivation, I guess. That ladder leads to the valley where Terra sleeps. Yeah. That's what I figured. Alright, some more travel banter. Hey, are daggers really useful? They seem so short. They're useful, alright. A dagger in darkness slides right into an enemy's heart. I bet your bow can't do that. Well, no, because with a bow, I don't need to get that close. I sniff him out from a distance and make a shop, make the shop I smell. But a dagger is faster and sure. I mean, with a bow, I can hunt animals across a whole canyon. Well, with a dagger, yeah, but a bow can. You know, if we teamed up, we'd be unbeatable. Huh, this could be the beginning of a beautiful partnership. Can I steal from this guy? Nah. All right, we got a new dungeon to go into. Path, path to the bed of the Titan. Probably gonna have some like decently leveled enemies. Hey, the customer. Oh yeah, we got more. What to do? Well, well. Dang, what are they? It's Okay, I'll, I'll take some good chicken. Arrow for you! Maybe next time. Oh, shit. 
Uh, extend the reach of a single ally skill to all for three turns. Alright, that's good. Okay, for the moment. But, uh, let's see. I don't need two people with evasive maneuvers. Let's throw on elemental augmentation. So, hopefully, she has solid magic now. Base 229, 14, uh, 414 with the. That. Wow, that axe is so strong. The fact that their magic is comparable. Kind of insane. Yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's no just do it. having a good time. Knight's great. Yeah, it's not as good as what I got. Let's see. Anybody else using the bow? I mean, I guess this is slightly better in the offensive department. Protective bracelet? Probably just upgrade defensive stats, right? I mean, but that's that's quite a lot. Stab somebody tanky. Merchants are typically a little more bulky, anyways, so let's just add to that. Oh, these guys are, uh, well, well. Goodbye. Next, I take what I want. I forgot that the reason why I'm not doing as much damage is because I don't have a Temenos. Temenos debuffs their physical. So, that's why. I'm not doing as much damage, but that's fine. Alright. I'm assuming we may have to fight Terra. I've heard the stories ever since I was a child. They say Terra sleeps at the bottom, way down there. <clears throat> Whoa! What was that? Hmm. Things are not looking good. The wind good. rushes in, then out. It must be... Tara's breathing. What? what? It's causing we that much wind? We hate to interrupt wind. Tara's wow. sleep, but we need to pay it a visit. Is she gonna jump down? <laughs> you can't fly, Ochet. But you can, Mahina. There must be some way <laughs> down. Have you tried a rope? It's too, too dangerous. I can't let you do it. If we can't go to Terra, huh, why don't we call Terra to us? With jerky. Good idea, Mahina. You're as sharp as ever. <sighs> Terra! <laughs> Wait, don't shout like that or... It's gonna work. It's gonna be pissed though. Whoa. <sighs> Thanks. That would be bad. The breathing's getting ragged. Tara might be about to wake up. And he may be pissed. That was too much. 
Try waking it more gently. She doesn't know gentle. Uh, sure, sure. Watch this. Hmm. The arrow is still falling. Must be a long way down. Hmm. Bruh. Hmm. Bullseye! How is that Another gentle? Earthquake? No, this is. Oh, Who Yang. Who dares disturb my slumber? Good morning, Terra. Sorry I woke you up. <laughs> Calamity is on its way to Toto Haha. We need your help. <sighs> Bitch, I was getting my beauty sleep. Long and peaceful was my slumber. And you fucked it up. Huh? Until you woke me up! Alright. Let's go. Tara's climbing the cliff! Yeah, you should get out of here. Brace yourself! Okay, let's do this. Is boss fight tag. Me thinks he's just gonna be weak to well, ice. I don't think it'll listen to reason. Oh well, we'll just have to take Terra down by force. Let's go, Mahina. Come on, Terra. Time to shine. Oh yeah, there we go. That's the music I'm I'm looking for. Ice right, I'm assuming yep, the ice makes right. sense. Oh, this is the buff I get from it. What Still to a thousand do? HP and plus and plus physical attack. That's really good. Go for later. You're open. I don't think she has great Bring damage, which kind of sucks. But I got how much more money do I have? Handle. How much money do I have? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. I want to so badly. I'm not going to. It would be very funny, though. It would probably just straight up kill this boss. Okay, so that reduces the cost. I'm just, I was just curious. It's your ship Some now, of the violinists. Friend. I don't even know what they do. One damage. That's what they do. It's my turn now. This is what it means to be a star. Spread the effects of single target skills to all this is not effective eye skills. I'm gonna 
lose the magic buffs, which is gonna suck. I think what I'll do is I'll donate BP. I'm investing in you. I owe you one. Gaining time. Then. Critical scope. Right. Let's see. Okay. Actually, so what I can do, is I can max boost. Uh, defendi's bow. Come on, defendi. All right. I can. More crit now. Uh, I'm investing in you. Check. Ready? Watch me. Alright, so we'll start with our progressive. Okay. My turn. Wait. Oh. And Aver's Reckoning. Aver, Prince of Thieves. That's 9k right there. Max instincts. I think I'm gonna do max damage no matter what. That's my course. Yeah, that was actually too much set up. Alright. Interesting. Listen, arise! I'm just getting warmed up. Alright. So they're vulnerable to less things now. Uh, pretty like fine healing wise. Shit! time. I actually want to say well, that. Well. Taking passive damage now. Interesting. Oh yeah, I forgot. Double Tomahawk does it. Does an easy, easier break. Time for some fun. I guess My I'll turn. get another advanced magic ready. Um, no, I don't want to start that up. Physical defense is already down. You're open. Yeah. Let's extend that just in case. Partitia's going last, so I'm gonna want to donate these to now. I'm investing in you. Uh, use her divine skill. Let's go. Rip. Whatever. I think this may go. Did not. Okay. Looks like Terra's getting oh, tuckered out. Did. Cool. Time to make the capture. Get ready, Terra. My turn. All right. <laughs> Bring it on. Shucks. Bring it on. All right. What uh, to do? Here we go. Are mine now, Terra. Phew. Terra finally calmed down. Hmm. I feel logy. Perhaps I overslept somewhat. How long have you been sleeping, my dude? Hmm. Those ears, that tail, 
You are a beastling. Yes. Of course, I understand. Yeah, if only now. you paid attention. I guess you couldn't see us when you're when it you were approaches, woken up. I take it. The night of the Scarlet Moon. I told you all that stuff already. Were you still asleep? He was just waking, waking up. Waking from a decades-long slumber takes time. There was a hunter, fearsomely strong, who challenged me to combat. Our battle reached the heights of ferocity, grievously wounding us both. The hunter departed, and I sank into recovering. the depths of the earth and slept. A hunter? I have slept since then to heal my wounds. You should have woken up by now. He was enjoying Perhaps, his nap. Perhaps, but it is warm down there and quiet. <laughs> he was a fine place <laughs> I to respect dream. it. I respect it. It is? Huh. Maybe just one nap. Huh. <sighs> Let's save it for after the battle. Battle's over. We won. <laughs> this is not exactly what a hunter does every day, Pom. So is he Terra really there that strong? you are. We were looking for you. The town has been shaking all day. Well, won't be shaking anymore, don't you Tell worry. Tell me it wasn't your doing. It was. Oh, that? Uh, yeah. I kind of had a little fight with Terra. Oh. Uh, don't worry, though. Terra's coming with me now. That should be good for your stomach, right? I... I see... You're leaving already, Ochet? She's got to continue her journey. Uh, I guess this means no more of that delicious jerky. Just make it yourself. <laughs> Not to worry. I'll come back to visit. Really? I'll treat you to a meal then. Oh, with some meat you hunted yourself? <laughs> I've given up on hunting. That I'm was not quick. Cut that took for like. It. Ten minutes. Instead of hunting, I'm going to raise cattle. They're gonna be delicious. Wait and see. Ooh, I like now you're talking. I like the chat's theme. I'll definitely be back for that. See you then. Goodbye. Nice quick story chapter. Chet makes contact with the creature of legends, Terra. He informs it of the peril facing Toto Hapa. She learns that Terra was wounded by a hunter. The young beastling marvels anew at this world beyond her whole island. Shaking her head, she hurries on her way, for there is much more world she has yet to see. Another part of the chapter two done. Alright, what do we got next? Looks like areas are sh like some areas are starting to get a little higher level. Like that's like that's now 28. Let's see, we got 31. I think this is 34. Thirty-one, thirty-one. 37, 37, 39. Alright, I kind of see. I kind of see where we, we need to go. So I know I saw that there was a cave that was like a level 31 cave. That's level 34. I know there's an optional boss in there and I kind of want to fight it. I don't want to fight it. Um, let's see. So first, real quick. Thank you. 
I think she needs to do more damage at this point. Let's do, uh, let's do, uh, Father's Roof. Yeah, I guess we'll start with this. Uh, do I want to change my party? Eh, I should be fine. I really want to see how much damage Terra does. I must kill you. That's what I told father. I must be a fool to have followed his orders. Anyone else would set a trap to kill me before I could kill them. But I know him. He didn't choose this place to lure me into a trap. There must be some other reason. He probably just wants to, uh... This will to be the last her. time I put up with Father's schemes. It's time to see what he has in store for me. Alright. We'll start with some travel banter immediately. Agnea, if you don't mind, could you sing me a song? For some reason, I'm in the mood for music. Of course, Throne. Rest, little one, for the day is done. Queens and kings, too, were once just like you. Now it's time to close your eyes and rest until the sun does rise. What was that? A lullaby my mother used to sing to me. It has a way of soothing my heart. I thought it might help you. Thank you, Ed Egnia. I feel at ease. <laughs> I'm glad you do. Now then, let's go. Um, I'm just, yeah. Uh, I do want to heal up real quick. Well, it's because, actually, do I even, I can just... Boom, done. Now, I can probably steal more things now. Oh, let's buy that history book. Thank you, Yeah, this is, this is a town we haven't been to in a little while. Let's... <laughs> We're definitely able to see a lot more things now. Asian plus 50 I'll is good. Take that. Yeah, these guys kind of these guys kind of suck now. Out. how much money I can make off of sellable stuff. I'll take... <laughs> what level is Therene? Yeah, she's almost level 40, so she has, like, good chance to steal anything here. <laughs> wow, an 80%. That was surprising. Actually, like take a look at allures, see if there's anything good here. Out. Like if I see anybody good, I'll try to pick them up because I have two people that can pick pick people up. So. Yeah. There we go. Probably not enough right now. I'm probably looking for something five or above.
Alert chances are like surprisingly low. God, that's it in that house that I need to... You know, I could probably... Ch now that I have Terra... I kind of want to give it a try. I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna give it a little try on this, on this guy. Go get him. Oh, it's like an alt. Not as good as I thought. It's very he's good very job. funny though. She actually recovered the rest of her SP off of that. Cool. Alright, we got a new area to explore. <laughs> Let's play. I've been waiting for you, Throne. Of course you have. Are you prepared to die? <laughs> I could ask you the same. Is this where you want to breathe your last? Don't be so hasty, my girl. There's got to be a, more of a build-up to it. Why don't we talk a little? I don't have time for that. Come now, Throne. Give me one last chance to speak to you. After all, only one of us will walk away from this. Is that wrong? I was born in a poor town. I oh, learned give us how a sad to thieve and wield a dagger just to survive. In time, there was nothing I couldn't steal. Before long, the town I lived in felt much too small. So we wanted to go to the big city. I left for the city when I was 17. After that, I joined the Black Snakes. I was once tasked to sneak in and loot a certain manor. And that's where it happened. It was like destiny.
My Mark was already dead. Done in by a woman. She was also there to clean up the place. Huh. It looks like we're in the same line of business. Unfortunately, you're too late. My name's Marietta. Uh, Sebastian. Oh, he used his real name. I guess being wealthy isn't all that great. You're always a target for the less fortunate. Yeah, I guess so. Apologies, but this treasure's coming with me. You can have it. How generous of you. What did you come here for, then? I've seen a lot of bodies, but... I've never seen a wound like this before. It's as if the gods themselves took his life with a dagger. So, I'm I assuming Throne is Marietta's kid. <laughs> I wooed that woman. It took me all night, but I eventually won her heart. Oh, we so were young. is she actually? Unfortunately, time passed. Eventually, we decided to run away together. Oh, the Black Snakes did not like that, though. Are you really reminiscing at a time like this? We're getting there, we're getting There's there. There's no better time, if you ask me. There's an abandoned church ahead. That's where we swore to love each other forever. Hmm. I'll be waiting for you there. Come and find me when you're ready, Throne. Pretty obvious, I guess they I they were in love. They had thrown a, and then but he was and she was killed, and he and he had to go back to the black snakes. But definitely, no, I'm noticing my damage at night is starting to fall right. off. Lightning bolt! Uh, to that. What to do? <gasps> Well, well. Next. So those enemies died. I, I guess because I was hitting, I was I actually want. hitting weakness damage. Weakness damage does boost if I a decent amount of guardian amulet. What does that do? That's a lot of fizz defense. You know, honestly, I just want two mighty belts. Maybe I throw something else on him, yeah. You know, weirdly enough, that extra 50 uh, defenses of each defense, that actually saved him in that one random encounter that he almost got killed turn one. That was good job on sale to show them. Right. Ready? Don't be shy. <laughs> That's a funny sound. I should write this down. Oh. oh I right. want to see. I'm gonna capture this guy. That's pretty powerful. Yeah, just a slightly stronger double cleave. I'm and down. hungry. Yeah, that's where she died. That's her, uh, that's her, her tombstone. This is the place, Marietta. What a sad little church. But it is our sad little Lost church. By no one, just like us. <laughs> then it's perfect. Say, Seb, did you know that there's something that can never be stolen? Hmm? It's something not even the greatest thief can take. 
something within that no one can see. A riddle, huh? So what is it? Hmm. Before I tell you, I want to hear your answer. Uh, oh, me? Yes. What do you think it is? Um, my skills with the dagger. I've worked long and hard to get as good as I am. And no one can take that from me. <laughs> I should have guessed. So, what's the real answer? My heart. You'll find out in time. Shall we be on our way? Uh, not even a clue? Ah, fine. <laughs> you can tell me about it later. Abandoned church level 31. Items right off the bat. Let's Soon we're gonna get like a better dagger or a better sword. Yeah. Well, well. And it's pretty obvious. Uh -huh. yeah. Lightning bolt strike! Uh -huh. Burn brown and I'll stand up both next to that one at least. Black Dagger. Slim chance to blind the target. I mean, this... It's not bad. More speed means more damage with, uh... With her ult. Actually, we're hitting pretty hard with it now. Do I want... Deal more damage? I think I do want deal more damage. Uh, who am I putting in basin? Yeah, that'll work. She's not really buffing too much right now anyways, so... Out of there, friend! <laughs> well, well. Hey. Uh -huh. Well, it's pretty obvious that that one's weak to so Who wins a favor now? Right. My Calm down. Uh. Here goes. Bring it on. Ooh, you know what? I can actually bring it on. My now. Now let's grab some food. There we go. I actually am starting to get like a good, good uh, variety. Can I like organize these? Let's see. So I hit for wind, thunder, bow, dagger, and axe. Up. God, I have 20k SP on um, Throne. That's way more than I need. All right, time for the final piece of the story. Here we are, Marietta. It's wonderful. Yeah. Now we can. We can what? Uh. <laughs> What's wrong, Sebastian? 
Tell me, Marietta. The answer to that riddle. What's the one thing that can't be stolen? It's a baby. A baby? Yep. Yes. That's one of the things I was thinking of. Our baby. <sighs> Aren't you happy? He's just kind of surprised Pikachu to face. To be honest, I'm scared. All my life, all I've ever done is take. I don't know how to protect something. It's the first time I've ever been so scared. <sighs> Marietta, I promise to make you happy. You and our baby. Marry me. Aw. Seb. Now where's it all gonna go wrong? Throne. This is where it happened. A perfect place for it to end, then. She and I swore an oath of love to one another here. Back then, I had decided to put thieving behind me and live an honest life. Not just for myself, but those who depended on me. But then what happened? Marietta was your mother's name. <gasps> Funny that the person that we father. call father is actually our father. Then that means... I'm your real father, Throne. <laughs> if only that were the case. I wish it were. Oh. Were we played it like a but fiddle? So would be a lie. What do you mean? Marietta met another man. Oh. She fell in love with him. And killed our baby. <sighs> Marietta left me. And eventually had that man's child. That child was you, Throne. Oh. Oh. So, who was he? The founder of the Black Snakes. The beginning of it all. What? After that, I killed Marietta. I slit the throat of the woman I loved with this dagger. They subverted my expectations. <gasps> they got me good. You should have been my daughter. Father! I raised you as if you were truly my own. More precious than anything. Enough talk. Damn. Everything I've done has been for this. Damn, this that's alone. sad, actually. Holy shit. I've made up my mind, Father. I will kill you and leave the Black Snakes. I will finally be free. This is where you fall. He looks a lot. He looks a lot different in this in this uh, big sprite. I never cared about the Black Snakes. To me, it was nothing but a Saint bloodlust. Ever since that, my heart's dried up. Only blood can keep it from falling apart. I did it for more, Throne. So I killed and killed again and again. This feels like a final again chapter. Again. And every well, time I guess I this is like one of the main two objectives. I quiet, but not quenched. <laughs> now, let me see you bleed, Throne! Father! Feels bad. Go on then! Very good snare. Father. 
All right. You're too kind. Yeah, that makes sense. Time to shine. All right. Uh. I should write this down. Let's see what we got here. Axe. That's good. Bring it on. Let's this. get to work. Just raise my defense. Sure. 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 <laughs> Worth it. My turn. All right. Um. Let's see. This will be valuable. Now then. This is what it means to be a star. Alright, now. Uh, lion dance. Hey, we lion dance to then Throne and Ocean will be doing more damage. Hey, let's pick me up. Adds more debuffs if I boost it. Okay. Watch me. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Hang in there. Time to get back to work. My turn. Hang in there. The show must we go are on. Fine. Here goes. Here's a pick me up. I owe you. Get some heal heals going. I think this is a good time. Yeah, I think it's a good time. It's my turn now. Alright, so they're both boosted with physical attack. Ronnie goes first. So I could just go for the max crit damage. Nah. Learn more weaknesses. He's got 50k HP. What to do? Wait, actually, right now I can crit scope. So that's your weakness. I'm just getting walked. Thank you. Just a heal up chat, Brone. Thank you. His healing is actually kind of weak right now. All right, Aver's reckoning. Prince of Thieves! Alright! Okay, that doesn't work. I was just wondering. Um, I throw out a large soul stone if I really want to. I wonder what it'll be. Right. That's pretty good. I'm starving! Um, let's see. 
I just want to see what else I can do. See how much damage this does. That's my quarry. 20k, okay. <laughs> ah, very good, Throwman. How does it feel to cut through my flesh? Let's go. Does it feel like your hands were destined for this? <laughs> I'm not like you, father. I just want to be free. <laughs> Is this another one of your antics, father? No, I raised you to kill me. I waited for this. God, that's so, so sad. Long. You what? Come now, Frodo. Put an end to me. Pierce your dagger straight into my heart. What? Kill me. Kill me now, Throne! How about this? Artisio! Alright. Uh, let's see. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? My engage is not filled up, so I can't do. I can wait for Seal Teach. Write this down. Vulnerable to wind. Wait, that's so good. That's Shucks. so good. Oh, I'm bleeding. Here's a pick me up. Right, let's just max boost to heal. I'm probably gonna take some bleed damage. My turn. Or something. Power. Wanna steal? Thanks. Eh, she, it didn't have anything Ready? good, Sag. Oh wait, I don't have the I will hold back. Oh, that's so sad. I messed up. You're too kind. Oh, I didn't get to get the kill. Let's oh, I tried to do it, but I messed up my numbers. It's okay. Yo, her I'm EX hungry. skill is so goaded. Marietta. Oh, that's the name of. Oh, uh, he named his dagger after, after his lover, Sag. Father. I hope that's a good dagger. Why don't I get to play like the other kids? We play together all the time, don't we? Not quite the same. It's not the same. The other kids have toys. I have daggers. Like cute little bears. 
And you've got a dagger. <laughs> what more could exactly. you ask for? Forget I asked. Oh, don't be mad, Throne. This world is full of very bad, very filthy people. Like himself. Which is why I'm going to make you better at cleaning than anyone else. <sighs> if you do a good job, I'll buy you those raspberries you love. Okay, father. For as long as I can remember, you've taught me how to wield a dagger. I killed people, just like you told me to. All for this. But this is the first time I've ever felt afraid. Afraid to lose you. Uh. Father. Would it be okay to call you dad? Aww. Finally. I've become a real father. I'm so happy to have a daughter. But Throne, you won't be free. Even after I die. Why not? Your key. Go. Meet your real father. We gotta kill him. I got what I came here for, but my heart is not yet satisfied. Instead, it feels empty. <sighs> you won't be free even after I die. Go, meet your real father. What does it mean to be free? Who is my real father? Father's words ran through my mind. I wondered what they meant. Until. Hey, yo, what's up, blank. Obsidian? How you doing? It's been a while. How you doing, my dude? All right, and that is Throne's Chapter Three: Father's Root done. That was good. I like that. They they subverted my expectations. Now let's see the dagger I just got. Marietta. Slim chance to instantly kill target. This game is really cool. If you like turn-based games, this is this is it. This is some good shit. The extra physical attack's good, but the extra speed is also good. Eh, yeah, it'll be fine. It's like, this this game is a lot better than the first one. They, like, took... Took what was good about the good Or, what was bad about the first one. And they've made a lot of improvements. And I really like it so far. Like, the stories are a lot better. The combat's still really good. The characters are fun. They actually, like, interact a little bit more. You know, let's just do Mother's Root. We just finished Father's Root. Let's just do Mother's Root, too. It's the same level. You playing some KOF with, uh, with GK? Mother's Garden should be around here somewhere. Many snakes are raised there, but no one knows exactly where it is. I've never been there myself. I was raised by father, not mother. Now then. 
It's officially an orphanage and has the support of the local monastery. You could probably sneak in as a nun. You're solo right now. Fair enough. Well, I appreciate you stopping by, my dude. I suppose I'll need another change of clothes. That uh, that Donkey Kong art that you Time posted yesterday was a habit. very blurst. I showed my friend, and he got a good chuckle out of it. Thanks for the stuff, sucker. Now to put these ropes on. That child. Very suspicious. Her footfalls. She's concealing her presence. She stole something. Impressive. She's no amateur, that's for sure. She may even be one of Mother's. Probably. It seems the slaver spoke true about the orphanage. Alright, let's hear some travel banter. You look good no matter what you wear, Throne. Thank you, but this habit is unfortunate, to say the least. Not at all, I think it makes you look real elegant. I suppose... Though it's too light around my, t too tight around my neck, and too and too loose everywhere else. Oh, I think if you change that up, it would look amazing. You got a good eye for fashion, Throne. Eh? Don't I? All right, leave the tailoring to my papa. Huh? I might do just that. Throne, Throne likes the good drip. All right, let's see. Who are our lowest levels? Oswald needs to get in. The issues of a swap of Chet in. I basically have no damage. So we set up Particio. Swap out of Chet. We keep Agnea. The goal is I'm trying to keep everybody, like, well-leveled. Oh, yeah, she's got the fortune wand. She's got the jade staff. It's fine. Uh, I should also equip some secondary jobs. Maybe merchant? Nah, cleric is... Cleric is the classic. Elephant's Wisdom, greatly boosts the intensity of a single ally's spells. Heck yeah. Evasive maneuvers for now because I don't know if I have any extra evasive maneuvers right now. Alright, then we'll just uh, double check with equipment shenanigans. Let's see. Rosary of Redemption plus. Where is it? Blessing in Disguise. augmenter and then probably doesn't need extra SP so let's just give him some extra defenses all right time to go to mother's garden oh we need it we need to be nighttime we need those damage buffs <laughs>
41 on, uh, on Threne. That's pretty good. Stinging Dagger is probably not as good as Marietta, so... I'll do what I must. Oh my god, flamingos? <laughs> well, well. I wasn't expecting flamingos either, so I understand your sentiment. Alright, here's Mother's Garden. Ah, new sister, are you? Yeah. That I am, sir. Go on in. There's the bell again. It has a beautiful sound. <laughs> I suppose so. That probably means something sad. <sighs> Mother's Garden Orphanage. This must be the place. Looks pretty normal on Those the outside. Are mother's children. There are so many of them, yet it's deathly quiet in here. She's trained them well. Ah, uh, there she is. I cannot wait to kill her. She literally looks like a clown. My Have you been good, little girls and boys? Thanks to you, Mother's got her hands on something very precious. Oh, there's that older one. Now tell me. First on the right. Which of you brought this home? It was me, Mother. Come here, Mira. That's the girl from earlier. This is a wolf diamond. One of the most precious stones in that the world. That random Joshmo just had it on him. I want you all to learn from Mira's example. You made Mother proud, dear. Allow her to reward you. With the mark of a true snake. <sighs> oh, she's getting collared a up. Collar. It suits you, Throne. How was it, seeing blood for the first time? <sighs> Mother dear, snakes don't Imagine wear colors. My bread. <laughs> With this, you're now a proud little snake. But she likes she likes Which putting collars on these. Me, your mother. On these kids. No. My mother died after giving birth to me. I will have none of your back talk. Really? Immediately with the whip? <sighs> if you want to live, you'll learn to bite your tongue and listen to me. I cannot wait to yes, kill her. Mother. I cannot wait to kill her. It suits you, Mira. What a pretty collar. I'll do whatever you ask, Mother. Oh, Mira. You what don't know anything yet. What a good little girl you are. When the time comes, meet me in the Black Bell Tower. Yes, Mother. Morozov. I leave it to you to open the door. But of course, Mother. To 
unlock this collar, I'll need Mother's key. Oh, we'll be getting that. And I shall take it, along with her life. Probably gonna ambush that guy at the door. I must find a way to get to her. And then that'll be the dungeon. <laughs> I like that she still ha she has the sprite on the save. There's that girl again. Ah, it hurts. Don't worry, I'll fix you right up. <clears throat> Use this. Uh, a, a handkerchief? Thank you, sister. <laughs> he made a mistake and got punished by mother. Whenever we fail, mother calls us to the other side of the door. What door? The one that's always locked. Morozov only unlocks it when Mother calls us. And that's usually for something bad. I've been whipped more times than I can count there. You'll learn to bear any pain in time. I'm a slow learner. They called me worthless. That must be why my real mother abandoned me. Damn, that's fucked up, Sag. It's time. I have to go now. Bye, sister. Hmm. She was quite helpful. So mother is on the other side of the door. How convenient. And the man named Morozov holds the key. But not for long. Time to ambush this motherfucker. Oh, I could also just steal it. So this organization raises children to be thieves. Why does such an atrocity go unpunished? Because of demand. A demand for those who can fill the wishes of others, even if it means stealing. As long as that demand exists, thieving will thrive. Children should not be made to spill blood. This must change. I wish for a world where children never even have to see blood. That sounds nice. If there were more people like you, I think the world would be a slightly better place. What? Mother's well, trusted aid and the man who manages the orphanage and the nuns are un employer are all black snakes. They dress like sisters to convince the townspeople. <laughs> True. Alright, time to enter the true mother's garden. Yo, wait, this gar garden looks kind of cool. So that's where mother is. All right. I guess we just gotta go through this little this little area. It's probably not gonna be too <laughs> difficult. Let's play. Oh, let's try a divine dual edge real quick. Yeah. That's pretty good. That's pretty Fire good damage. Burn. Well, well. And death. Next. And so it goes. I do love me that nighttime damage. Calming stone. I'm um, assuming that prevents terror. Yeah. Stand aside or fight. Now. Mm -hmm. 
rice. No. Well, well. Too easy. All tidied up. Horned Helm. We haven't gotten equipment in a while. We haven't gotten a... No, it's not even that good. Never mind. I was about to say, like, we haven't gotten equipment like that in a while. I probably have so much money. I could probably just Dance spam or hire, like, high tier hired help. Yep. Uh... Next. My well, well. Bye. Next. And so it goes. I feel like my, uh, my dagger one does more damage because I actually have a better dagger. I don't under I don't know how, like, attacks like that work. They're always, like, a little funky. Stand aside. Or but, like, with different weapons, they have different stats. <laughs> so, like, flat, like, oh, this is your best Burn weapon. Sacred flame. Or, like, you only have one weapon because you can have so many in this game. Huh? Well, well. Easy. Yeah, like that feels. That looks like it almost looks like 3K. Numbers are going by quick, but I think I'm seeing high 2000s. And I'm seeing low 2000s using one of the other ones. Take what I want. Oh. oh, that's not looking good. But before we do that, I will be right back. I just need to go to use the bathroom and refill my water, so I'll be back in like a few minutes. Alright, I am hydrated now. Okay. It is time to kill mother.
My dear little Mira. Oh. Now that you're a true snake, there is a little fairy tale. What the heck is this? Know. A fairy tale? Yes. It's a prelude before the real fun begins. Oh, she's got to get whipped a bunch. Once upon a time, in a faraway land, there lived a man and a woman who were deeply in love. Oh. But they were a prince and a princess. Oh, that's talking about uh, Sebastian and Marietta. And it wasn't long before war broke out between them. So they decided to run away together. Yeah, it keeps the focus. Actually, this has more. This it's has been better a context. While, mother dearest. This has much better context. Uh, at doing oh, father's side Rone. first. There you are. So you knew that I was here. It's not every day we get a new sister, which is why I asked Mira here to lead you to me. It's the perfect place to dote upon my daughter without interruption, is it not? So that bell tolls when it's time for punishment. Your twisted ways haven't changed one bit. She's a little bit. I never She's an old bitch. you to make it so far in the selection process. <clears throat> Why have you come? Don't tell me you missed Mother's whip. Now we're gonna take your key. Though I suppose you do know it's sting better than anyone. There is no better way to control someone than through pain. I agree. I've come here to punish you. Oh, got him! And once you're dead, I'm going to leave the Black Snakes. You wretched worm. I know you, Throne Hay. I abhor disobedient children. From the depths of my soul. All right. I won't hold back, oh God, she's hideous. Now. Oh God. I mean, I knew she was gonna be gross, but dang. The winds of favor blow. It's even worse than I imagined. Calculations come. Cleaning time. <gasps> You're open. Here I come. Hmm. I think I'll just do divine delay. <laughs> My turn. He's gonna run at SP really quick, which is gonna be annoying, but now then. Um, let's see. Guess I'll do when you refrain. Ready? Doing, get Matt going. Um Guess I'll shackle this guy. You're open. We need a play. Oh yeah, his is so much better. Ooh, thank you. I actually, I'm actually down for that. So I think what I'm gonna do. I should just want to see what she's vulnerable to. All right, cool. Thinking time. Feel my wrath. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to. Do this. Right. Do some heavy damage. Ready? Um. Is this to? Is this to all uh, as swift as a snake. Foes. So, what we'll do is I will. I'll take this. Give myself two BP. But I won't hold back. 
and then Amber's Reckoning. Oh dang, I forgot to I forgot to switch ability back. Unfortunate. Nice. Okay. My turn. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that one bit. All right. Um. Let's see. Weak. She's gonna go first, so I'll reduce her physical no. attack. Okay, well. Call upon the miracle. Prepare yourself. And then. I'll do Ventful Choose Blade. Your next move probably wisely. gonna be an AoE attack. I return your wrath. I return your wrath. Ooh, that's super good, actually. How can I do this? Actually, what I can do is I can just wait a full turn. Terror's gonna last four turns, so I do want to get rid of that. I need this. My turn. Yeah, I can. I can wait. Um, let's see. Hang in there. You're unconscious. Thinking time. Use this. Much appreciated. All right, get all my SP back. All I need is two turns. Here I come. Um, let's see. I can do precise shot. Strike, time to strike. Get a little bit of damage down what now. What to do? You're I'm aggressive. We need a plan. Calculations. Magic. Gaining time. Mother. Aber. Prince of Thieves. All right. It's my turn Get now. Heavy damage in. Um, I can do whatever I set my mind to. Seal T just won't help me right now. Ice wind blow. Here but I go. I fight for my but friends. You know it does. We'll do something. I summon Brand, the Thunder Blade. Oh, that didn't kill. No. Feel my wrath. This will probably finish, right? Rise, fierce blizzard. Nope, did not finish. That's not good. You truly are that wretched woman's child. What are you talking about? Oh, Theron. Let me tell you a little secret. The woman who I once called Boss. Was oh, your okay. Friend. Maybe we should... Okay, so this gives me more context uh, for this, but technically this was in the reverse order. She was a remarkable thief and deplorably strong. My mother was the leader of the snakes? You had no idea, did you? I suppose you wouldn't, since father swore me to secrecy. But I set her up. And had her killed, and seized control of the Black Snakes. That's how things have always been, and the battle between successors continued. I don't want to be anyone's successor. I just want to be free. Free, you say? Very well. Allow my whip to free you from your worldly bonds. Got extra extra moves, it's fine. Time for some fun. We actually may be able to re-break her. Oh, never mind, she had just I a thousand HP left! Oh 
Let's go, let's go. Actually, this does give more context, because we didn't know uh, Sebastian and Marietta were, like, in love. How pathetic. Any last words? It looks like it was out of my reach, too. What are you rambling on about? This is just a whole <laughs> messed up situation. That mother set up. Throne. Please be happy. Be better than me. You can rest easy, boss. I'll take good care of her for you. Yeah, she just she just wanted to make Throne miserable. <laughs> you wretched worm. I should have killed you then. Along you with your contemptible mother. I never knew my mother was the former head of the Black Snakes. I don't remember any of it, but it makes no difference to me. Your mother's skills were great, and I knew it was only a matter of time until you inherited them. So why didn't you kill me? Because of father. He said, if I killed you, he would kill me. <laughs> this is a little triangle. That old bastard. <clears throat> he always adored his little girl. You don't say. Well, he's dead already. I'm done listening to you. Give me the key to my collar. I don't take orders from dirty little harlots like you. If you want it so badly, you can pry it out of my cold, dead hands. With pleasure. Have it your way. There's no such thing as freedom, Throne. Once a snake, always a snake. Bruh. She's the only mother I have. Please, don't take her from me. Your brain, your brain's a little messed up. Hate me all you like. Mother! <gasps> mother! Yeah, we can get her a new mother. I'll never forgive you for this. <laughs> My name is Throne. Remember it well. If you want revenge, come and find me. I await your challenge. Bruh. This girl's been a little messed up in the head. Oh, hello there, sister. My apologies, but I'm no sister. Oh, I see. 
And I don't think they'll be needing your services here any longer. Mother is dead. Hmm. Don't you worry about it. There's always work to be had somewhere. Good for him. You're a very kind man. I had two mothers. One who gave birth to me, and one who bound me. They were both snakes. And I am their daughter. But does that mean I too must slither as they did? Someday, I want to roam this land freely on my own two feet. You go, girl. Farewell, Mother Dearest. I really like Throne's story. It's like... It's like, just complicated enough. And it's like, interesting. I'm, I'm enjoying it. I'm glad I picked Throne as my starting character. <clears throat> and now we the get the little we get the little in line. the little combined end of chapter three. I took them in exchange for my parents' lives. <laughs> the triple apostrophe. With these keys, I should be able to remove this abominable collar at last. I will finally be free. <laughs> she needs a third key. The keys. They don't fit. She has a special key. They don't fit. But why? Yep, she has special locks. <sighs> These keys should have unlocked it. <clears throat> but if they're not for this collar, then what are they for? And where are the keys to my collar? Her real dad has it. I have to go back. I have to be sure. I have to return. To the snake's nest. And I'm assuming that is where her chapter four is. What level is it? 45? Yeah, that's 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 some end game stuff right there. All right, all right. So Cassie's chapter three is pretty low leveled. That's probably what we're doing next. Yeah, it's looking like it. Is there anything I can, else I can do right now? That nameless, we could maybe do that nameless aisle soon-ish. All right, so we need to change some party members around. Let's see. <clears throat> so it'll require a lot of setup, but we can just have Casty be our damage dealer for this. I think we should be okay. We'll see though. What job do I want to make her, though? Hmm. I guess getting Mercy Strike... I mean, not Cleaving Blow would be nice. Uh... Whatever does it... Which of these classes... Does it raise her speed? That doesn't raise her speed. That raises her speed a little bit. And I want low speed. So maybe we just keep warrior. But like this gives more offensive stuff that I could use. I think it'll be fine. As long as I, as long as I just keep her keep the stats low. Got deal more damage, summon strength, yeah. 
He's got like all the strength based stuff, which is good. Got the double tomahawk, raging beast. Blessing in disguise, reserve of redemption. Alright, so she's got 514 fizz. Which, pretty good, pretty good physical attack. If I do say so myself. All right, time for Cassie's chapter three. Let's, fi we'll figure out a, a little bit more of who she is as a person. Helix. <clears throat> Something bad happened here. Seems deserted. Malaya, where are you? Hello, Malaya. Are we gonna have to fight you? Malaya. You came, Casty. What were you doing here? You're asking the wrong question. You should instead be asking, what happened here? True, everything is pretty messed up. Does the word Santanejo mean anything to you? Nope. It was a flower of great importance to heirs apothecaries. Santanejo. <laughs> Good, Casty. It's finally time to remember. It's time to remember. I'll even lend a hand. All right, we gotta inquire what she knows, and then uh, let's see what's gonna happen. Cassie now recalls searching for the Centenejo blossoms with a, with another members of Bayer's apothecaries. This memory comes from time to time when a band worked together to save people's lives. Centenejo Blossoms. That is our keyword. Our story starts two years ago. It was a summer filled with the fragrance of green. The season of clouds and rain was right around the bend. What a lovely looking village. Am I going to die? No, you're gonna live. <laughs> He's got Help a very deep coming. Place. Just hold on. And there she is, the best apothecary in all of Air's apothecaries. <clears throat> you're faster than expected. How is he, Malaya? In a great deal of pain, but <clears throat> lucid. I've patched him up as best I could. We were right to keep him here for observation. So what's wrong with him? Here, Lind. This should ease your suffering. Pulse strong. Breathing steady. Good. Thanks. I'll be able to climb up and fix that darned roof for sure now. <laughs> <laughs> Easy there, old timer. Learn your limits. You're not climbing anything. A leaky roof won't kill you, but recklessness will. You worry about getting better. I'll worry about those repairs. Casty, really? Carpentry isn't our vocation. <laughs> but that won't stop our mother hen here. She just can't resist clucking over her charges. <laughs> she really do be the party mom. No teasing. Oh, where's Trousseau? Sorry I'm late. I had to see an unexpected patient. Speak of the devil, dear. Welcome back, Trousseau. 
Who was this patient? Sally. She fainted, so I went to see what was wrong. I administered to her, and she seemed stable for the time being. Here, my notes. Though, I'm still concerned for her. I'd like to follow up on her soon. <laughs> I'm not surprised to hear that. You care more about your patients than any other apothecary I've met, Trousseau. That's the heart of what it means to be a healer. To extend a helping hand to all those in need. Casti's creed and words to live by. It was the force of her spirit that brought us all together. That creed's what makes our order special. So I'm assuming Trousseau was the guy that started the Purple Rain, which I'm assuming but killed no this working village. Yourselves into the ground. Let's all take a break, yes? I wonder what made him go crazy. So I'm pretty sure he also had a mask. How are you and Andy getting along? My brother's insufferable. We feud as often as not. I only wish that knucklehead had as much brain as he did Ron. If he was as clever as Malaya... <laughs> He'd be a force indeed. Still, it was thanks to his verve that you're standing here, yes? Yeah, guess I owe him for that. I suppose Andy's got at least one good quality, huh? You two make a wonderful team. Let's go party, moms. Alright, let's see. Why is... She and Randy have pledged their lives to one another? Oh, that's cute. Also, the one is... Randy oh, wait, no, I think that was from the, uh, from the Inquirer that made it, uh, highlighted. He was? Uh-huh. Jay is just such a sweetie, isn't that right? It must be nice to be so loved, Jaya. My sister sent me a video video of Ken. Alright, that was anything special. We'll save Trousseau for last. Older brother. Wanted to become a soldier. It's <laughs> oh, he likes Casty. I was just about to head up to Lynn's roof. See what I could do. Thanks for handling that for me, Andy. <laughs> no need for thanks. Leave the muscle work to me. I got the brawn for it. <laughs> you certainly do. Well, off with you then. Finally, so Young member of Heirs Apothecaries with fervent, idealistic desire to save lives. Three years ago, he joined the band after meeting Casty in Winterbloom. His boundless enthusiasm leaves, leads him to treat patients at all times with little regards to his own need for sleep. How's Sally? Right as rain, and playing up a storm. I was a fool for worrying over nothing. There's no shame in feeling concern for a patient. In fact... I believe your empathy is your greatest strength. <sighs> Thank you. Well, guess I'll check up on some of our other patients. That should about do it. Everyone seems to be doing well. <clears throat> now to my last job for the day, sorting through all these patient notes. Him? Who's shouting? What's all this ruckus about? His face is as pale as a ghost. What happened, Tem? It's Sally! She... she suddenly fainted! I yelled and yelled, and, but she wouldn't wake up! He just helped her. Could you take me to her, Tem? 
We'll all go. They say three's a crowd, but what's six? Let me take a look, Trousseau. This swelling on her forehead, it wasn't there before. Some catalyst must have exacerbated her injury after you left. There's no way you could have predicted this, Trousseau. Still, still he feels medicine bad. medicine to reduce the swelling. Wait, you don't mean Santanejo, do you? Santanejo blossoms? Those flowers that grow on the summit of Mount Lithia? That place is rife with monsters. It's too dangerous for anyone. He's gonna go. Hold it, Trousseau. Where are you off to? Flower picking, I presume. Please don't. You'll just end up another patient. We have medicine that can help with her condition. It won't do much, but we should try it first and see. That's the but smart thing. Santanejo blossoms are the only thing that can save her for certain. If she can be saved, I want to do it with my own hands. <laughs> Wait, that's. Malaya, you and the others use what salves you have on hand. Keep her stable until we return. Trousseau and I will go gather the blossoms we need. Chief. Hold it! There's caring for patients, and then there's risking your life. You can't... Don't worry, she's a healer, but... No, Andy. I can, and I must. I share Trousseau's feelings. This child's life is on the line, and we must do all we can for her. <sighs> Those are the chief's orders, Andy. We could use Andy we'll with us. He's got a little, he's got a little keep her bulk alive, to him. Andy. Just be safe out there. Thank you, Malaya. Oh, okay. Just straight fast forward. <laughs> this is probably where we're going to be going for our dungeon. Chief, that's it. Those lovely red blossoms. And I think this is where um, the purple rain. We can unleash the purple save rain. Save her with this. Stay strong, Trousseau. Drink this. It's bitter as sin, but it will refresh you. Skybomb? You never fail to impress. How'd you know we'd need it? Cassie's gigabrain. <laughs> I never leave home without it. You all push yourselves too hard. Yes, we do. By the way, why'd you support my decision back there? Because you would have gone anyways. It was your spirit that motivated me. That earnest desire to save a life. And that you would have gone anyways. You showed empathy and kindness. As a fellow apothecary, it felt right to encourage that in you. <laughs> there you go again with that mother hen routine. It is our purpose to extend a helping hand to all those in need. It was that creed, your creed, that brought me here. You changed my destiny. I became an apothecary to cure my sister's illness. A malady said to be incurable. I studied for years and years. And in the end, my efforts were for naught. I watched her die in front of my very eyes. Yet, on her deathbed, she said this to me. Though my life could not be saved, 
Your hands are those of a healer. Help those in need. True so. There. We have the blossoms we need. Let's take them to Sally, Chief. She's waiting for us to heal her. And so we return safely to Sally's side. The Santanejo blossoms in hand. We saved her life that day. End flashback. Santanejo. Trousseau and I collected those flowers together. He was the gentlest of us all, and the purest of heart. And then what caused him to go crazy? Yeah, that's right. Too pure by half. It's what made it easier for the darkness to find a hold. And stain it with evil. What? Search your memories, Casty. You're almost there. Where are you going, Malaya? The town square. Come find me when you're ready. Should probably save after that boss fight. It's been a hot minute. Inquiring again. Casting Trousseau once in body, blah, blah, blah. That was before Trousseau changed. All right, time for flashback number two. Ah, <sighs> that was a long trip. Long, yes, but productive. We saved a lot of lives. Oh, but Trousseau was left behind. <laughs> And now, I'm happy to save my sore feet. Oh, I can't wait to dive into bed. <laughs> you were a trooper too, Jaya. Hans. I hope Trousseau had some time to relax while we were gone. <laughs> There's our mother hen at it again, clucking over her chicks. Oh, stop teasing already. Hmm. It's darker than it usually is at this time of day. I can barely see. Whoa! Easy there, Jaya. Hans. He's a little agitated. Oh no. The animals! Chief, I'll see to them. There's some Something's shenanigans wrong. going we on. We should hurry to the village. The healers are back! Help! Help us! It can't be. Sally! Tim! Of course, it's those two again, Sag. No pulse. What? The hell's going on here? What happened? Sally and Tem went out to play, but never returned. The whole village went out despite the rain to search for them. We eventually found them behind the mountain. But by then, there wasn't any hope left for them. Trousseau was here, wasn't he? Why didn't he help them? We went to the House of Healing, but no one was there. Trousseau Sus. was gone? But where did he go? Black swelling all over both children's bodies. Signs that both coughed up blood. Their blood is... black. Black blood? This must be some sort of poison. I have a bad feeling about this. Hey, Apothecary? I'm not feeling so great either. 
And the same goes for a lot of us. My body won't stop shaking. Signs of paralysis setting in. <sighs> oh, that's bad. Casty, what's going on? Black blood. Andy, Malaya. Quickly, they'll need help breathing. I couldn't save them. Not one. Damn it! What the hell's going on here? Chief! The whole town's dead. Bodies are everywhere. We need to stay calm and go over what we know. The first to fall sick were Sally and Tim. After that, everyone who went out looking for them fell one after the other. What sort of poison could do this? The rain is purple! Wait. Black swelling and blood, I know those symptoms. The puddles, the water, the color is all wrong. Randy, you're on. That black bruising. Huh? You too, Andy. Damn it. Now whatever it is, we've got it too. The rain. It's... purple? Uh, you should probably get out of it. Everyone, your coats. Quickly. It's the rain. There's some scourge in it that's causing the sickness. Look! Over there! A wildfire? No. Trees don't burn like that. Then what's causing that smoke? I don't know, and but Sidian, I have a hunch. Why? Why did you do it? Whatever evil infects this rain, that smoke is the cause. It's spreading poison into the air to rain down upon us. What do we do, Casty? If we do nothing, this pestilence will only spread further. If we are to save anyone, we need to stop that smoke. There's no one else who can help. It's up to us. We should probably, like, be going. what are we waiting for? Let's go! Andy and Randy, you're with us! Got it. Elma, you stay here. Help anyone you can. Let's move. Everybody's fucking dead, though. That's right. We climbed that mountain to find answers. Oh, interesting. So it's like automatically moving us. We needed to know what caused the rain that stole the villagers' lives. But I can't remember anything after that. We just gotta get to the next next I memory need thing. To remember. We gotta remember who to beat up. Oh god! I swim! Whoa! Sorry! 
Can't fight during daytime. Pierce them. It's my turn now. Uh, fireball. fireball burn. So that's it. Time. Ready for a surprise? Thinking time. Fire. Thinking time. All according to plan. God, I really noticed the lack of damage. It's gonna be a lot better now that I got uh got the damage up. I feel like I'm go oh, I went the right way on accident. Oops. Life is too precious to risk. Fireball! I take what I want. Who is that? The multiplayer in that move is crazy. Just got really high base potency. Out of my way. What? Well, well. Bye. Easy. All tidied up. Elements of war, that probably just increases elemental resistances. Yeah, it just increases elemental defense by a ton, but... I have plenty of elemental defense. I think it'll be fine. His healing is actually like fairly strong right now, so. He's about May I come this dance? Up. The winds of favor blow. Burn bright, oh sacred flame. Well, well. So I literally goes. had espresso at like six o'clock. How am I yawning? What is going on? All right, I'm assuming there's not actually gonna be a boss battle because there's no uh, save point beforehand. It can't be. Dead. What dead. the fuck are you doing, dead. Tuso? Dead. Dead. Rain! Storm! Keep on pouring! Ah. Hello there, Chief. Welcome home. It's a shame to see you here. I tried so hard to pick a time when everyone was absent. But you always rush to help those in need, don't you, Chief? Trousseau? You're the cause of all of this? Explain yourself! Now! The smoke? I'm burning a special sort of poison. <clears throat> It'll rise up Yikes. and up, turn into clouds, then rain on down. That's... that's evil. <laughs> These are tears, friends. The tears of those suffering in this world. What are you saying? Do you understand what you're doing? 
Of course, Chief. I'm following our precepts to their logical end. What? Extending a helping hand to all in need. Isn't that right? What? <laughs> this rain brings salvation. Trousseau, Sally and Tam are dead. I know. I killed them. Sag. Oh, dear me. Our precious children are missing. Who cares if we get soaked? We must find them. Ugh. This can't be true. You... You used the children to lure the villagers out into the rain? Dude, what the fuck happened I... to him? You risked your life to save Sally once. I did. I was a fool who hadn't yet realized the truth. What truth? Didn't you say you want to ease people's suffering? Save them with your own hands? Come now, Chief. What do you think suffering is, hmm? Existence. Bruh. <laughs> do you remember sure, of the course you do that obsidian. joined that relief mission oh so long ago? He opened my eyes. I see it all so clearly now. He showed me the truth of this twisted world. We live on a vast graveyard of decay. Maggots glutting on rotting flesh. Chief, you don't look so well. Poison finally taking its toll, yes? No need to fret. I'll save you from your suffering. I'll save all of you. You should thank me for the courtesy. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're wrong. An apothecary's hands are not meant to take life away. And yours were the gentlest hands of all Trousseau. Casty! Open your eyes! This isn't like you! This isn't who you are! You go, Mom. Casty, forget it! He's beyond hope. Get a hold of yourself. We need to retreat. Return to the village. He's right there. We can just bonk him. No! We need to put out this fire! Doesn't look like it'll be easy to douse. He's likely got enough phosphol to burn for days. The logical thing would be to run, to save who we can save. There may still be some left alive. Why, Trousseau? Ah, <coughs> uh, she's getting hit Cassie. hard. There, there, Chief. No regrets now. I'll extend my hand to all those you can no longer save. In fact, it's time for me to be on my way. There's to be a coronation in Timberane, a kingdom far to the west. I hear so many will be gathered there to see it. So very, very many people. They won't be expecting me to rain on their parade. Oh god, he's so fucked up in the head now. No. Don't. Trousseau. Yo, he got the ability to teleport? You monster. 
Randy! Yeah! <laughs> Malaya, get the chief to safety! Andy! Randy! I got one last lesson for you, Trousseau. This is what it means to extend a helping hand, no matter what it takes! No! Oh, they're fucking stomping it out. Damn, you could actually see their faces just get real bad real quick. No! Uh, what a shame. The fire's out. Yeah, oh, they went out swinging. I just about finished with this place anyway. My poison spreads through the air too, you know. All I'll right, see you later, my dude. Thanks for stopping hide. by. Hope to see you again my sometime. My dearest colleagues, I bid you farewell. Uh, what happened to him? <coughs> yeah, so it's just those two the left. Smoke stop, but the rain doesn't look like it'll let up anytime soon. <laughs> Malaya, Casty, hang in there. Casty, Casty. No, I won't let you die. Hold on, just a little longer. It's snowdrops. Swallow these petals, Casty. <sighs> what are those gonna do? That should allow you to fight back against Trousseau's poison. Only find a way to turn these flowers into a more potent brew. Damn my inexperience. Come on, Casty. She's been with them the whole time, and it's she just bad. Oh yeah, is the other girl still there? Or is she dead? Old man, old lady. All the vi other villagers. Delma, where are you? Someone help. I know that, Winnie. What was that, Hans? Aw, oh, she protected the horse. Oma oh, gave her life to save you. She was truly a kind soul. Get out of here. You've avoided the rain, but the poison is in the air as well. We need to get out of here. Please lend me your strength, Jaya. Probably like walk. Yeah, there we go. The rain clouds are blowing off towards the mountains. And we should head the other way. I must save Casty. I can't afford to focus on anything else. <coughs> Live, Casty. Live. And that is how we got to where we are today.
Oh, it's still misting. <laughs> or it's still raining. Leia. Cassie. You have the power to save lives more than any other. That's why you have to live. Here. Take this flower. It's a snowdrop. A rare flower. With the power to cure the black blood. I'll store it in your satchel for you. Only hope of saving people from this foul lane. How did Malaya make it out of here? <clears throat> if anyone can create a cure, it's you. It's up to you now. by Hans. Live, Gasty. There's someone you have to say. It's your boy Trousseau. Just you and me now, Jay. Let's see her off. Oh my gosh, Chief. So, has Malaya just been a figment of her imagination? So, you've remembered everything. <sighs> Malaya. She had some schizophrenia. You're no longer in this world, are you? That's right. I'm just fragments of your memories. A phantasm. A dream. Sag. Just... a memory. That's why I can only tell you things you already know. But now, at last, that job is done. Well, goodbye, Malaya. Malaya. You did some good. You and the others saved my life. Now it's my turn. I swear to you, I will stop Trousseau. I believe in you, Casti. Goodbye. That was oh, a nice yeah. non uh, non combat uh, in ca uh, chapter. At least I'm assuming it's going to be non combat for the rest of it. Oh, she's done. She disappeared into purple mist, of course, to represent the poison. So I'll come crashing back to Casti. Joyous days spent with dear friends and the horrible tragedy that befell them. The murderous Trousseau has revealed um, where he will strike next. Timberane. That's where his rain will fall. Her purpose clear. Casti puts the ruined village behind her. She must stop her former colleague before he commits yet another heinous crime. And that is her chapter three done. Oh, my controller went to sleep. Oh, okay, we're over here. Yeah, because they have to go quite a bit of distance. 
Let's see, I'm just curious what we got next. So there's a lot of stuff over here, so that's probably going to be like the next area we go to. Yeah, Timberane, that's going to be where her last thing is. We got a lot of area over here to uncover. I guess we're going to be doing this next. Um, I think that's going to be it though for for tonight. We're hitting about we're hitting at about three hours, and I could go a little bit longer, but I want to get some stuff done before I go to bed. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, I'll be streaming on Sunday, I believe. I'll probably be doing like a long most of the day stream, so long as I don't have to like do other stuff. I may have to like make food and all that kind of stuff because I have a uh, I got you know the next week to prepare for. But I'll have to think about that on Sunday. So. Uh, enjoy your weekend, and I'll see you guys on Sunday. Have a good night.